Welcome back to another episode of the Hello C.S. Dorsey podcast. I have been gone. Yes, I have. I just came off a five-day podcast launch challenge, which was so amazing, so awesome. So shout out to everyone who joined the challenge, who was engaged. It was the most fun challenge that I've had in so long. So I'm really excited about that. I introduced my new program, Overwhelmed on Air, to help those who want to launch their podcast in 30 days. It was so amazing. I'm really happy about that. And yeah, so I will be having a, another challenge. It's not going to be called a challenge. It's going to be called a boot camp. I will announce that soon, but it has been a blast. So I'm back, okay? <laughs> I know I haven't been recording a couple of episodes in a couple of weeks, but I'm definitely back. So what I'm going to do throughout these uh, next couple of episodes is I'm actually going to go over some questions that uh, people who were in the challenge had. And I took those questions um, that they were asking and I'm going to answer those here in the podcast. So this isn't going to be your typical Candace podcast. Uh, it's going to be solo, solo episodes. And they're going to be roughly maybe five or 10 minutes. I'm not going to be on here very long these next couple of episodes, but I want to definitely answer the questions that uh, a lot of people in the challenge were I seen ask and, it, you know, keep coming up. I want to ask those in these next podcast episodes. I'm going to do this probably maybe the next eight episodes, the questions, and then I'm going to answer those as well. Today's episode is going to be how to record your podcast even if you're on your lunch break. I started my podcast, most of you know the story, I started my podcast in my car on my lunch while I was working my nine to five and I guess it was the hardest thing that I ever had to do but it was also the easiest less stressful thing that I had to do. I had to figure out things along the way but doing it on my lunchtime definitely gave me the time that I needed to actually record because a lot of people think that you need to record an hour long podcast and that is just not true. You can have a two minute podcast. You can have a 15 minute podcast. It's totally up to you how long your podcast should be. And I will be having a podcast episode on that coming soon to talk about how long your podcast should be, but it doesn't really have to be that long, okay? And also, too many people spend way too much money on launching their podcast and think they have to have all the fixings and everything, and that's not true either. All you really need is your phone and a voice note app. I tell people all the time, that's all you need. So I'm going to give you five tips on how to record your podcast while you're on your lunch break. So if you have 45 minute lunch break, you can record your podcast in 15 minutes and then eat your lunch the rest of the 30 minutes. Okay. And it's just a great way just to, I feel it's very therapeutic. It really is just to talk to you guys and just have that space to just be able to take that time, especially in the middle of the day while you're working. It is very, it is very I won't say exciting or rewarding, but it does give you some sense of release to kind of like be somewhere else other than work just for a moment. So here are five tips on how to record your podcast while you're on your lunch break. So number one, what you want to do is go ahead and grab that sticky note off your desk, okay? Or get a little outline book or, I mean, get a notebook or something where you can actually create a mini outline with a call to action. You don't need a big binder, a big notebook, or anything like that. What I'm looking right now in front of my face is a sticky note with line paper on it. I mean, with lines on it. Grab one of those and then just start jotting down a quick mini outline, okay? So your outline should definitely be your podcast title, three main points, Summary, call to action, that's it, okay? Then number two, you want to get in your car. So get in your car. If it's hot, I'm recording this at during the summertime, so um, it's probably really hot. But go somewhere quiet. Maybe you're, you're the only one in the break room or 
just walk around outside. You can definitely do that, especially if you're working in some sort of like business type environment where it's not very noisy, it's not industrial. You can just walk around and it's pretty quiet. Do that, okay? If you don't want to get in your car because it's too hot. Number three, get your phone out and download the voice note app. I know that with with Android and with iPhone, they both definitely have some sort of free download where you can download the voice, a voice note app so you can record your voice. Okay, download that. I know there's one for free. You might get a whole bunch of ads pop up, but that's okay. All you need is something to record. Okay, number four, start recording 15, 10 minutes. That's it. That's all you need. Definitely have that call to action at the end, though. What do you want people to do after they listen to your episode? And then number five, save it and go back to work. That's it. That's it. If it ain't up to but five minutes, do it. (laughs) Just do it. Just so you can have something and you can get started. Okay. If you do this every day for five days on your lunch break or whatever time you have, you will have five weeks of podcast content. Okay. So don't make this more complicated than it needs to be. So let's recap. Number one, get a sticky note. Create a mini outline with this call to action. Get in your car. Get your phone out. Download the voice note app. Start recording. Five, 10, 15 minutes. I would say 15 minutes will be the cutoff. Save and go back to work. That's it. Do it every day for five days. You have five weeks of podcast content. So you have like a month and a week of podcast content right there that you can publish. So if you're a coach, consultant, course creator, or service provider, and you want to launch your podcast so you can grow your business, your audience, and amplify your message, I have a free podcast launch guide that will help you set the tone and the foundation for your podcast. The link is in the show notes. Are you going to do this? I want you to commit. I want you to say, yes, Candace, I'm going to do this. This is a quick and simple, easy way to launch your podcast. Okay. So until the next episode, I will talk to you then and take care. Bye.